And we are following more breaking news now, this time from Tinley Park, where today the man accused of killing his wife and three daughters over the weekend was in court. And we learn what prosecutors say was the motive behind the crime. NBC 5's Lexi Souter reports. We're learning new details today of how a domestic family argument turned into a deadly shooting. Assistant State's Attorney Scott Clark. The defendant called 911 dispatch for the Tenley Park Police Department and reported that his wife had been shot. That was Sunday morning around 1120. When police arrived and spoke with defendant Maher Kassam, he directed officers to the basement where police discovered his wife and three daughters all shot to death. The officer asked the defendant, quote, this was you? And the defendant nodded his head in the affirmative. The defendant stated, quote, I'm the only one. I'm the only one, unquote. The defendant also showed officers where he was hiding not one, but two guns in the home. The 19-year-old son of the couple witnessed the argument and the shooting. Witness one observed the defendant shoot victim four and then walked toward the exit from the basement where the defendant shot victim one twice. All of the victims were shot multiple times all over their bodies. As for a motive, the defendant allegedly told police it was all about money and that he had just retired after working most of his life. The defendant later said, quote, wife's worried about money and where she can take it. Bury me and take the money, unquote. After hearing the state's case, the judge said that Mr. Kassam is a threat to his surviving son and also to the community. Therefore, he will be staying behind bars until his next hearing. We expect to see him back in court on February 16th. Reporting in Bridgeview, Lexi Suter, NBC5 News. Thanks to Lexi.